Welcome back, officers of the Republic. It is your Coruscant Underworld Police Chief. AP Gaines here. There's a lot of new people, so you guys might not know Coruscant Underworld Police Chief, of which precinct, the 69th precinct, of course, if you're wondering why everyone has a level 69 cup. It's the summer of the 69th where we're taking over. All that good stuff. Today's video recommendation comes from a subscriber. I think it actually came from Running Bald Man. I actually cannot remember. I'm 99.9% .9 sure it came from Running Bald Man. Shout out to that man. He's a legend in the AP Games community. And I actually got about 20 other video recommendations on one of my previous live streams. Uh, some super serious constructive videos, some more fun like this one. Hopefully you enjoy them if you want to see them. And know when they go live, make sure to hit that bell notification button. Boom! Just inserted my YouTuber. I'm, I'm becoming a professional YouTuber, guys. I'm not just some kid in my mom's basement. I'm a professional YouTuber. I plugged the bell notification button. And I did a one-minute intro as of... Now, boom, I'm a professional. We're going to talk about how to actually have fun in Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes. And apparently that involves having an eyelash in my eye. But even though I just said I'm a professional YouTuber, will I edit that out? Or start over from scratch? No, because I might just be a kid in my mom's basement. Now, I haven't actually thought this video through, but we're going to go through with it with point number one. Become part of a fun Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes community. Now, it doesn't have to be mine. It doesn't have to be the 69th Precinct. Link to our Discord. First thing in the description. Fantastic place. Most active Discord in all of Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes. For any content creator, it's the best one by far. No uh, no personal, personal reasons I would tell you that mine is the best. It just happens to be fact. But even if you... This is the first time you've seen me. You're probably in some sort of Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes community. Whether that is you are a follower of one of the bigger guys, one of the smaller streamers over on Twitch or even on YouTube, or maybe it's just your guild, your guild's Discord, there are thousands and thousands of Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes communities that you guys could be a part of. And to be honest, they're the only <laughs> they're the only thing that keep me going. I don't know about you guys, but if it wasn't for like the 69th Precinct, to my guild, uh, some of my old guilds, some old friends that I have that we're no longer in their guild, but we still talk from now and then, um, Star Wars Galaxy Heroes wouldn't be as fun. I'm sure a lot of you guys have a similar feeling about that. Uh, it just makes it it just makes the gear crunch. Uh, CG, we need better gear farming. This is getting absurd at this point. It's been like what six years, and you can't fix this for us. Why do I need ten thousand Kyrotex? That being said, uh, joining a community is definitely just a fantastic way to improve the quality of life of this game. Um, you know, bantering about like I just did about gear grinds, uh, just talking about life and stuff like that. Joining some sort of Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes community is definitely the single best way to have fun in this game. Now, what's another thing? Uh, the second thing is going to be kind of self-explanatory, but this is a game, and it is a Star Wars game, which means you probably are fans of the Star Wars universe. And if you've guys noticed, especially AP Gains here, I, I recommend, you know, I have my, like, AP Gains approved farming strategy. Of course, it's the most efficient uh, and best overall for the entirety of the game. So if you want to be a GAC player who gets, you know, who always wins, that's the strategy you want to follow. But sometimes people don't want to farm up, you know, Relic Django Fett. I don't know why you wouldn't. That's a terrible example. Django Fett's awesome. But maybe you just don't really want to farm up Clone Sergeant to get Glock at uh, the new Galactic Legend Glock right here. Maybe you don't want Bo-Katan for Glock. Maybe you really, really hate Padme for some reason, so you don't want to have a nice Padme team. If there are characters that you guys are fans of, I actually did some roster reviews on my live stream. Most of my live streams, let's be honest, are just roster reviews at this point. Um, and I came across an account that was pretty heavily focused into Bad Batch, but I could tell that it was still a free-to-play approach to Bad Batch. Obviously, we have the community hub here. Shout out to the community hub. Um, two guys, you know, came together and did a Bam Rush account, which is obviously far from the best possible farming strategy. Um, I, I, some of my old guildmates have like full relic Ewoks before, well actually Ewoks are still bad, but maybe you have your level 69 cup at 6969 GP with, I'm pretty sure some of his mods are like, no, I was too lazy. I, shout out to Aaron who has like 69 speed, 69 potency. I guess my mods on my, uh, my cup are just weak. But there are characters who aren't really good, but if you like those characters, I have some guys in my guilds who've got relic out Tuscans. If you want to pull out some relic out Tuscans for three-man undersized in Division 1 GAC and actually get pretty good banners, I've seen the footage, go do that. That's It's a game. You're allowed to have fun. Um, if you want to farm up Eeth Koth and throw him in with uh, Hoth Rebel Scout, Biston, 
uh, IG86 Sense on Droid and Lobot. If you want to be like Urz and do Lobot versus the meta, if you want to be like AP Gains and just make meme videos all the time, you can have fun in this game. You don't have to be super efficient. Don't let the pressure of every video from every YouTuber, everything, any Twitch streamer streams being super efficient in GAC. You guys are allowed to go out there and have fun. It's not a cardinal sin. I know it feels like a cardinal sin sometimes in the Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes community, you know, to go out there and have some fun, but it's not. <laughs> so uh, feel free. And, you know, obviously this is the perfect segue. Um, what's another way to have fun? Figure out how to turn these things off. Someone said you could, and I still have no idea. Watch, I'm going to open up like Squad Arena. Is it past 11? It's almost 11. Are they going to open up another one? They oh it's the same one. Mindless destroy. Oh no, I guess this is not the hyena bomber. This is the vulture droid one. Special limited time offer. So I guess another way you can have fun is figure out how to turn these stupid advertisements off. I know I'm the CEO of Capital Games, but seriously, guys, this is getting out of hand. I might have to fire Crumb. Drop a comment if you want me to fire Crumb. I know he's obviously not the person to blame for this, but um, <laughs> but we're firing Crumb. Crumb. Guys, this is a stun gun. YouTube, this is a stun gun. I know it's different from live streams where people actually look at my video. This is a stun gun. If you guys like this video, here's your stun gun. But not until you like it, here's your stun gun. Guys, honestly, the uh, the AP gains you see on YouTube videos is drastically different from live stream AP gains. And uh, I spent like four hours today. No, it was more like two and... It was like three hours live streaming today. And I still haven't exited live streaming mode, so I'm kind of a little crazy. Even though it's been like nine hours since I finished my live stream, whatever. I'm just going off on a tangent at this point. But the game can be fun. I mean, you can theory craft new ways to go through challenge tier uh, raids. Not challenge tier raids, but challenge tiers on assault battles. You can throw together wacky lineups for GAC. You can uh, speedrun conquest. I know I we have, I think, eight speedrun world records, or eight world records. No, eight speedrun world records in Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes, the 6th and 9th Precinct holds. I think I have six, and one other guy has two, part of the 6th and 9th Precinct. You could help collectively add to our world records here at the 6th and 9th Precinct. Of course, we're always appreciative of, uh, of getting, you know, the 6th and 9th Precinct over there on the leaderboards for Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes speedrun community. Which is surprisingly big at this point. Um, not trying to brag and say that I created it, but <laughs> who was speedrunning before me? The course on Underworld Police Chief of the Sixth Ed Precinct AP Gains. Um, but let's be honest, guys. The, at the end of the day, the most fun that you can have in Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes is coming to an AP Gains live stream. I don't have a streaming schedule, which is why you got to hit that bell notification button or just have notifications on Discord. I know Discord notifications are annoying. Because I ping everyone all the time whenever I have some stupid idea. Honestly, I treat Discord like Twitter, even though I don't have Twitter. I just be like, ha 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 ha, blah 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 blah, at everyone. And people are like, it begins, stop pinging us. We don't like you. It makes a stupid sound on my computer. I'm like, okay, boy, sorry. Uh, dude, it's late. I gotta, I gotta go to bed. Actually, how about that Bad Batch episode? How about that Bad Batch episode? No spoilers in the comments. No spoilers in the comments. Um, this video is going up in a couple hours. It's so nice living on the West Coast. It just comes out at midnight. It's so nice. Oh, fantastic. I love you guys. Here's a stun gun. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.